of civilization from simple communities to chieftains, 4500 to 2000 BC. In the ancient annals of history, the dawn of civilization marks a significant turning point in human development. However, defining what constitutes civilization remains a matter of debate. Some identify specific attributes such as writing, cities, and monuments, while others emphasize the crucial factor of complexity. Join us as we delve into the journey of human societies from simple farming communities to the emergence of chiefdoms, exploring the critical role played by agriculture and advancements in technology. At the core of civilization lies complexity, brought about by advances in agriculture and technology. These pioneering societies succeeded in achieving a surplus of resources, liberating a significant portion of the population to engage in sophisticated, organized, and creative endeavors. As agricultural techniques improved, certain communities were favored by the bounties of their lands. Slowly, these simple farming communities began to grow in size and complexity, laying the groundwork for the emergence of chiefdoms. Agriculture played a pivotal role in the rise of chiefdoms. Areas that could sustain intensive farming saw the development of hierarchical communities, housing up to 20,000 people. Within these chiefdoms, status became hereditary, and the highest-ranking family senior member assumed the role of chieftain. The chieftain exercised power through a warrior class and had the authority to commission significant constructions, such as tombs and temples. Chiefdoms were not merely centers of political power but also places of cultural and religious significance. Evidence of collective worship is found in the remnants of ancient shrines and temples. The first chiefdoms arose in Mesopotamia around 4500 BC, followed by Egypt in approximately 3300 BC. Soon, chiefdoms sprouted among the Minoans in Crete, the Indus Valley in India, and in China. By 2500 BC, farming communities in Western Europe and Central America also experienced the transformation into chiefdoms. The evolution from simple communities to chiefdoms marked a pivotal moment in human history. These organized societies laid the groundwork for what we now recognize as the early stages of civilization, setting the stage for even greater advancements in the future. The bountiful floodplains of the Tigris and Euphrates in Mesopotamia, the Nile in Egypt, and the Indus in India provided the perfect conditions for communities to thrive. Chiefdoms, once based on kinship ties, evolved into city-states, and the world's first civilizations were born. As these communities expanded, rulers faced the challenge of maintaining authority and loyalty among their people. Religion played a central role in ancient societies, and often, the community's chief priest also held a leadership position, with the support of the priestly class. Law codes were created to uphold order, and bureaucratic systems were established to administer these new laws. To elevate their status, rulers commissioned grand public projects, including roads, canals, temples, and palaces. The growth of civilizations brought forth new challenges. Administrators, merchants, and traders could no longer rely on memory alone to store vital information. Thus, the need for writing systems arose. The earliest known writing was discovered on clay tablets in the Sumerian city of Uruk, dating back to around 3400 BC. This complex system consisted of over 700 signs, indicating that writing likely began its development much earlier. Initially, Sumerian writing was used for accounting and record-keeping, gradually evolving to encompass law codes, chronicles, letters, religious scriptures, and literature. Writing systems emerged in all early civilizations. Some, like the Sumerian, started as pictographic systems, where each sign represented a simplified picture of the object or action it depicted. Others, like the Egyptian hieroglyphics, used signs to represent words or parts of words. The first alphabetic system, where each sign represents a sound, was devised in the Eastern Mediterranean around the 1600s BC. As societies transitioned from nomadic lifestyles to agricultural settlements, they acquired material possessions and demarcated territories. Conflicts over resources led to sporadic raids and skirmishes among tribes in the Neolithic period. However, true warfare, involving organized armies and states, emerged with the city-states. These states amassed enough agricultural surplus to maintain standing armies, which could be deployed defensively to protect wealth or offensively to expand their power and influence. The first civilizations witnessed profound transformations in governance, communication, and conflict. With the development of writing, religion's role in society, and the emergence of warfare on a state level, these ancient societies laid the foundation for the complex civilizations that followed. Thank you for joining us on this captivating journey into the past. 
Be sure to stay tuned for more enthralling insights into the fascinating world of ancient civilizations. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more historical explorations. Until next time, farewell.